What is up, guys? Jero's Rants coming at you, and is it just me, or is the Black Spindle Quest too fucking hard again? And either I just completely suck ass, I mean really, really suck, along with my two other friends who are playing it, one of which is already completed the raid, who has 300 light, and the other one is 295 light. I haven't done the raid yet, because I don't have a raid group. So either we all suck, or this mission is too fucking hard and i made a video about this what, what was it four days ago a week ago something like that when it first came out about how overly hard this bullshit mission is and now i'm hearing something from my friend that it's gonna get nerfed so it's not even worth getting anymore why why is this mission so fucking hard for an exotic sniper if it takes three guardians 10 minutes to do this and when they finally kill this guy, they have Drixis, they have to kill, what is it, 50 fucking Fallen Knights, which just burn your ass to oblivion? Uh, no, it's like, to be realistic, it's like six knights that burn your ass to no way to hell. Even if I'm running around, I'm getting burned to shit. Uh, four fucking Fallen Axes, or whatever the hell they're called, the Centurions, which those ball things are stupid as all fucking hell. Because they send one out after another. And if you don't shoot them, you're dead. Sorry, you're dead. It, it's at least half your health gone. And since you're injured from the night burning your ass, you're dead. Then the Drixis, who literally is like a fucking pitching machine. All you see coming from him is black orb after black orb after black orb after black orb. And you move, he turns, he throws a black orb at you again. He turns again, throws a black orb at you again. You keep moving, he keeps throwing them at you. Nothing else. How the fuck is that fair? Now, I want the Black Spindle as much as the next guy, but this quest is the only way to get it. It's fucking stupid. There should be another way to get the Black Spindle. I don't even know what spot it's in, because I don't even give a shit about these fucking quests. And I know people oh, you need a Titan, just use a Titan, use the bubble and do it. No. No, 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 no. Fuck you. Not everyone has a Titan, friend. I, my friends, me and them all play Limited Destiny. I play Limited Destiny even though I'm a YouTuber. I play more Destiny now since I YouTube for it than anything. And we're not all Titans. My Titan's still only level 36. My friend's Titan's 37. We have no time to play as Titans because I'm mainly a Warlock, or a Hunter. He's mainly a Warlock, and his brother's mainly a Hunter. And then the friend we play with is a Warlock, who's 300. And two Warlocks and a Hunter, or two Hunters and a Warlock will not work. It is stupid. I tried being ad killing. I died five times out of ten. Fucking they died the other five. And I was killing ads. Trying to do it. But Drixis was attacking me with the black orbs. And then I would just die by the fucking Centurions. Bullshit ass fucking ball shit that follows you everywhere. And does not have a limit to where it goes. Not to mention, if I kill a Scion, somehow the Scion spawns a new one as it's dying. Its head explodes, it is gone for half a second, and then another one comes out of its fucking jizz particles. I don't know. Maybe when it dies, it fucking ejaculates and makes a copy of itself. It makes no fucking sense. I don't get how this is a thing. It's stupid. And to mention that there's 50 of them at you at once, and they fucking duplicate every five seconds if you're not killing them? Oh yeah, you you got a lot of scions on you at once. I'm surprised it doesn't lag. It's fucking stupid. I don't understand it. And just to get the sniper, which is about to undergo things, and the funny thing about, I'm going to go back to what I was, I just remembered what I was going to talk about. I made a video on this, how stupidly over hard this mission is for an exotic sniper rifle, which is at 240 light, which makes me feel like I'm facing raid bosses that is so fucking hard. I don't care that it's a 10 minute time limit. It, that's cool with me. That is really cool. The two things that piss me off the most is, one, I made a video on how hard this fucking thing is and how stupid it is to get this. And Bungie basically said, oh, it's hard. Okay, here's another chance. A week later. That's bullshit. Fuck you, Bungie. What the hell are we supposed to do with that if you change no mechanics whatsoever? The thing that pisses me off the most is that if you die, I mean, if you don't die, fuck that, fuck that. If your timer runs out, because if you all three of you die, you can just keep respawning. If the timer runs out and you do not kill every last fallen fucking or taken fucking enemy, which is stupid as shit, so that means if you leave three scions left, you're done. It doesn't reset you back to the time limit point. 
it resets the whole entire fucking mission, which is you running from one point to another just to run back while running back, avoiding fire, grabbing orbs, opening doors just to run into the fucking catch. That is about 10 minutes of time. That is aggravating as hell. Why not make it since you know they're going to replay it? If A, they get past that part and they reset it, you're at the catch. Or B, if you die while doing the time limit or the time limit runs out, you reset at the fucking ta catch instead of going to orbit like a goddamn nightfall. That is fucking annoying. Stop being assholes, Bungie. It is a fucking exotic sniper rifle that I've heard rumors that you're going to fucking nerf anyways. Give us a god- throw us a friggin' bone here. Shit. It's not hard to give us one weapon. It's not the Gallowhorn. It's not the Sleeper Stimulant. It's a fucking exotic sniper rifle. It's not gonna make or break the game. Help us on this. Make it easier in some aspect. I don't want to have to hear another bullshit saying, of, Oh, if you just have a Titan with Defender, you're good. No, fuck that. I I barely play with Titans. I never have Titans. My, I, like None of my friends play as Titans. Everyone plays as Hunters. And because I need a Titan, I'm punished? Because I don't have a Titan? If you don't have a Titan in front or you're not a Titan, you're punished? That's not fair. The, the way I hear it every time I go on YouTube or something is either split all three of you off, which it requires great skill, like amazing skill. You have to be so fucking good and agile. Or you get a Titan with two Night Stalkers. Now, the one with the great skill isn't bad because you can do whatever you want with it. You can be whatever fucking class you want. But the Titan one, really? You're going to limit to two ways. Either A, be really fucking good at the game... Or B, you have to have a fire team of two hunters and a titan. Now, I know your game is supposed to be played with all three, but really? You're going to make it where if you're not a titan, you punish us. That is fucking awesome, Bungie. Good job. Listen to our fucking feedback. Just because the Taken King went off good doesn't mean you can stop listening to our feedback. Help us. Help you. A, make a fucking better game. Stop being stingy bastards. Help us make a better game. I've backed you. I've loved this game. But to get a fucking exotic sniper rifle, I have to do a mission like that. And if I don't have two good friends, or if I'm the one that's holding them back, look at that. I can't get the fucking sniper. So why don't you help us by either A, making it easier, B, making a checkpoint system for the fucking thing, or C, not have it where we have to run all the way to the damn Crota Stone to grab the Stone of the Soulless Crota, or whatever the fuck you want to call it, just to run all the way back, get the damn relics, open the one door, which, oh yeah, by the way, you most likely die by that night at least once through your playthroughs, and then next, have to grab two more orbs. Oh yeah, and by the way, it's time, time so if you don't do this quick enough, so you really can't stick around and kill ads, if you don't do this quick enough, the door closes. So... Yeah, you got that going for you too, so good luck, good luck with that. So either you do that, and oh yeah, the two orbs, there's a night guard in both. And the night will always burn your ass, even even when I was invisible, the night was fucking burning me. Made no sense whatever, whatsoever, he did not see me, but he burned me very well. He like guessed where I was, even though I went invisible two seconds before I even went in. And then also the wizard that guards the door, when you try putting that fucking stone in... If you don't have a third ready to revive both of you, you're fucking dead. Because that wizard does unbelievable damage for a 240 light when you're at fucking 295. That is stupid. So, my solution for you, Bungie, is to listen to our fucking feedback again like you've been doing. But it doesn't seem like you are for the Taken King. Or at least, for at least the Black Spindle. Make a checkpoint system for the Black Spindle quest. Don't be dicks and do, oh, sorry, you have to restart the entire fucking quest just to attempt the black spindle B make it easier help us out and give us the fucking exotic in an easier way than oh you have to do this or at least make like another quest where we can try it or B nerf the fucking guy he all he does is throw the goddamn baseballs of thing literally back to 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 back. I am a baseball pitcher. I play high school baseball and I I'm gonna be in college baseball. I almost was. I barely missed the cut. And I cannot throw a baseball. 
back to 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 back like he can. That does not work like that. I don't get how the fuck you think he can do that. Literally, I want to see his reset motion because it looks like he throws it and he finishes like a baseball pitcher and then he's already throwing another one. How the fuck does that work? Fix that. Oh, yeah, and also fix the goddamn Centurion's bullshit ball seeking to, like, at least burst at a certain time or not have that insane of a dodge and seek. Oh, and fucking nerf the Scions, damn it. They, I don't think you meant for them to fucking duplicate every half a second or whenever you look at him, even if you're about to kill one and he just duplicated, you kill his buddy, the original, then you go to the second one, you're about to kill the second one, the second one duplicates. And it just repeats, unless you get fucking multiple headshots with a scout rifle or hand cannon. Alright, I'm done. I'm done ranting. If you have better ideas, comment below. If I suck, go ahead and say I suck. I don't give a shit. Fuck that. I really don't care. I'm just pissed off at this quest. Thank you for watching. As always, have a good one. And please leave a comment below and your thoughts on how to fix this quest to help us novice players work. And I'm a hardcore gamer at heart. This is fucking stupid hard. At least... It makes it harder that I'm aggravated when I have to fucking reset the entire mission. Like old school Nightfalls, that aggravates the piss out of me. So that does not help. So leave a comment down below. Like and subscribe. And just have a good one, guys. I'm done here. Goodbye.